Mm. Anything worth having, it's worth working for. Hey guys, I am back again with another video. And today we are finally getting seafood and I am stoked. So I'm going to say grace and I'm going to tell you what I have and we're going to get to grub it. Gracious Father, we thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. Pray that you would bless it. Let it be used as a nourishment to my body that I might better edify your kingdom. In your son Jesus' name I pray and thanks I give. And it's time to grub. Let's do it, guys. So today we got some snow crab on deck. My hair is flipping in my face, but it's all good. Uh, we got some corn, we got potato, we got a couple eggs. There's some shrimp down in here. And we got this Be Love sauce on deck. And I made it myself, but, you know, I did the best that I could. So, um, I'm just going to get it in. I'm, 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 I'm ready. My mouth is ready. I missed you guys. I was out of town. Mm. Mm. I went to, let's get to these crab legs. I went to see Kirk Franklin in concert. Mm. And when I did, when I tell you it was bomb, he always puts on a really good concert. And so I had a great time there. I hate when that happened. When I can't get to my meat. But while I was away, a lot of the restaurants had music and her, they were playing music. And so I just thought it better that I, um, that I did not record. I took a couple of pictures and I may add them, you know, like to the frames or whatever, but, um, I heard I was hearing something over there, but I'm through wasting time with that little one. Mmm, got a shell in my mouth. Mmm, y'all, that meat be so sweet in these. I feel like it's like a a June bug in here or something. That's what I said. I feel like I was hearing. I'm so mad. I think it's because my crab legs are cold. Well, not really cold, but just my sauce was super hot. And so... It's causing me to, uh, causing my meat to break. And I can't stand that. A lot of people don't like snow crab for the fact that it's a whole lot of work. But I work for it. Because it's good to me. Mmm. Anything worth having, it's worth working for. Or at least that's how I feel. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I didn't give y'all a bite. Let's see if we get this one out right. And then if we do, I'll give y'all the whoop there it is that's your bite have it take it mm. y'all i don't know how be love do the sauce but mm. i 
I feel like your girl was pretty spot on today. Mm. I feel like mm, I killed it. Mm, mm, mm. There's some sausage in here too. I don't know if y'all can see it. And we got some shrimp on that. Mmm. Mm-mm. 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 Y'all. When I say this food good, good. Like Applebee's. Mmm. We in good in the neighborhood. Do you hear me? Mmm. I feel a little uncomfortable. Maybe I need to scoop this back some. Y'all, do you know how hurt I would have been if I were to drop my seafood? Just do you know. Mm. Let's try some corn. Mmm. 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 -mm. Mm. 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 It just don't even make sense. My hair keeps getting in my face, but ain't nothing stopping this boil today. Nothing. Mm. 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 All that juice and them seasonings from the sauce get in this corn. Say, say. Hey, hey, it don't make no sense how happy food makes me, but I love the grub. I love all kinds of food. So today, earlier today, while in Houston, because that's where the concert was, we went to this place called Snooze. It was a brunch play. Y'all, now the wait was real it was too real however the food was bomb when i say bomb i mean spot on so i got this um i got this um i'm still gonna get all of this because I, I can see a little Ooh. Come on. Don't play with me now. But anyway, um, I there it is. I'm sorry, I'm just leaving these shells up here. But anyway, um so it was a brunch place and I got um, get some of this sauce. It's yum, yum, good. <laughs> like, be love some. But anyway, I got some, um, what do you call that stuff, Lord? Um, oh, Lord, I didn't put this back in. Oh, yeah. Mm. I got myself some, um, whoo. I know y'all know it at this point, but... My food's so good, I'm distracted. Some French toast. Y'all, if you ever go to Snoozes, or Snooze, it's a brunch place. And you're in the Houston area, they got this OMG French toast. Y'all, when I say it's OMG, oh, it's stuffed 
with like mascarpone cheese. I took some pictures, so maybe if, if my, um, that's my computer, but maybe if my editing, if I can get it together tonight, I can, um, get y'all some pictures. My hands are going to be filthy, but I'll wash them. It's grub time now. <laughs> anyway, um, if I can, um, maybe get y'all a picture uploaded of my, my, uh, my, um, French toast this morning. Oh, y'all, the bacon there. It wasn't just no, no regular store-bought bacon. This was some, mm, oh, I hadn't even seen that. Anyway, it was some, um, some thick bacon. It was just bomb. The whole, I love a claw. Mm. Love this claw. Anyway, um, it was some just really good bacon. It was thick. It was cooked just right. I don't like crispy bacon. How y'all like y'all bacon? I am not a fan of crispy bacon. Like, I want my bacon to be chewy. I want it to um, be thick in texture. Whoa. That just flew off. To the side over here we'll get that up later y'all look at that claw me look at it look at it mm. i want my bacon to be thick though i'm distracted because i'm trying to eat take this stuff apart but anyway so i um i was i was impressed the bacon was delicious the eggs y'all so, I forgot the name of these eggs, but they like supposed to be like fresh eggs, blah, blah, blah. Mm. Ooh, Jesus. Now, that was good to me. Mm, mm, mm. Ooh. So, those eggs, I like my eggs over medium. Tell me how you like yours. So, they were over medium eggs. Right, and um, they um had the yolk just. I mean, it was perfect. They were. It was like a creamy, whew, decadent. <laughs> I'm telling y'all. I think what's making throwing me off is that I'm talking about how good this food was earlier, but. This food right now is so bomb. Let me get one of these onions. Mm. Mm. Yes. That I can't keep my focus. So anyway. It was delicious. Absolutely delicious. If you're ever in the Houston area, get you some snoozes. Of course, I got me some Papa Gino's. Philly cheese steak. It was good to me. My sisters didn't care for it, but I could dig it. I could dig it. Want some? Mmm. Mmm. Y'all, I'm not even putting on tonight. I mean, I never am. This is just so delicious, delectable, delightful. Mm. Mm. I can't wait to find me some, I mean, order me some colossal shrimp. Cause these shrimp are kind of small. Mm. Still good. A little bit small. I want to try to be able to see them. So 
I got this food from the Tasian truck. Well, I got the crab legs from the Tasian truck. The crab legs, the potato, the corn. Um, crab legs, potato, corn, and sausage. So, mm, 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 mm. What I did was I came home, put my B Love sauce together, boiled me some eggs. Say. <laughs> mm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna boil them egg. Uh oh. Ooh. That hit just right. Hit it just right. Anyway, boil those eggs. And what I did was I put my shrimp. I chopped up my sausage, put it all back, excuse me, into my sauce while it was still like simmering. Mm. Cut my potato in half. Because you know they don't cook their potatoes. So I cut it in half, threw it in that sauce. Y'all. Yeah. Nothing better. Mm. 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 Why is this my last corn? Now, next time. We going in. <laughs> mm. Y'all, let me tell you something about seafood. You really can't enjoy seafood unless you're making a mess. How many of y'all agree with me out there? If y'all still here. You really cannot enjoy your seafood. Cute. You got to just. You just got to go for broke. Seafood is one of those foods you just don't need to eat on the first day. Let's just let that be established. Who agrees with me out there? You do not eat seafood on the first day. Unless you're trying to, you know what I'm saying, like, I don't know. I think me and my dude had an automatic connection, so I wasn't tripping. I think we already liked each other, so it wasn't like it was no... Anyway, that's up for another day, another story. But, so I think I could have eaten seafood with him. I didn't, but I think I could have. Um, um, but as far as first dates with somebody you're not, you unsure of, you know, you be trying to make an impression. You don't want to be sucking on no eggs, chewing corn, stuff. Because I used to always say, for you to, I'm just not talking no more. I'm kidding. I used to always say, man, I know the people feel that stuff running down on their mouth when I would watch mukbangs, but mukbangs, because that's all I watch, mukbangs, whatever. But mm. Um, when I started doing it myself, I realized only seafood boils, honey. Baby, that dead butter get the running, and the food be so good, and you be so focused, because you know you have to de-shell this stuff, get it all right. It's a lot to focus on, other than keeping your mouth clean. 
So, when I say everything good, everything good. This was just too bad to me. Like, nah, Kayla, you just really making a mess. Oh, I'm going to eat a couple more of these shrimp. And that's going to be it. I should have gave y'all another crab leg. But I'm full. Getting full anyway. So I have to save these for later. Last bite. Let's see if I can pick up me some onion, some ginger, some garlic. Y'all, be love, you did that. Like, excuse me. When I say you was on to something, sis, you were on to something with this sauce. Whoever came up with putting ginger, you know, like, Black folks, we don't even really cook with ginger like that. Like, let's just be honest. You know what I'm saying? I ain't try, I ain't making this no race issue. I'm just saying we normally don't cook with that type of stuff unless we cooking like um uh Caribbean food or something like that. We might put some ginger in it, but just as far as just and it's hot, I'm sweating. Anyway, but as far as just cooking with it, we don't. So that combination with that onion and that ginger and that garlic, though, say, say, look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. That was the best bite of the night. <laughs> best bite of the day. Woo wee. Y'all, it's been real. And I was eating so hard, I didn't even get a chance to give y'all no word today. Actually, I kind of did. I told you anything worth having, it's worth working for. So if that's your man, <laughs> your relationship, your woman, your whatever. If it's worth having, it's worth working for. I look a hot mess. I ain't got no lipstick no more. I don't know what kind of lipstick sass and B-Love be using. Because it be staying on. But, anywho, I enjoy having you guys. I enjoy being back and I miss y'all. Y'all, um, I would talk to y'all about that um, that spicy noodle challenge, but I already been on here quite a while. Just know that the spicy noodles was the hottest thing I've ever put in my mouth. Rewind. <laughs> Say it again. Spicy noodles, the two times spicy noodles from Samyum are the hottest things that I've ever put in my mouth. It was like the first bite, fire just shot down my throat. I was like, this is so disrespectful. Do you hear me? Oh my goodness. It was terrible. So anyway, I can't do spice. And my crazy self done ordered this sauce. Gonna make these wings and I'm gonna try to eat them. But I'm gonna get somebody over here that can handle some spice with me. Or me and Kimai might do it again. Everybody was tripping out because she's a little girl. But she eats it. As soon as we got done, Kimaya went and got some hot chips and some Takis and stuff like that. So, anyway, I had a blast doing it. But it was painful. If y'all don't um haven't seen it yet, go check out my spicy two-time spicy noodle challenge um, video. I'm getting off of here. I love you guys so, so much. I want you guys to like this video, comment on this video, subscribe to my channel, y'all. I promise you, we're getting down over here, like we grubs over here. Um, excuse me, let them know what your girl is doing on K Loves to Grub. Once again, that's K Loves to Grub. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video, same place, probably a different time, because y'all know how I do it. All right, I love y'all.